Yeah, no kidding. That's some, uh, that looks like a crappy brush pile a little bit. Yeah. I'll start throwing in front of the damn boat. God. That ain't a bass. Pulled off. That had to be a striper. Oh my God, who are you telling? <laughs> that, that was fun for a minute. I, yeah. That's just the 1.5. I would like to have at least seen that striper. I mean, he just knocked it silly. It's a little like a pretty good little place to throw a jerk. If it's a green one, it's a damn giant. This is why I'm afraid to throw my jerk bait. That's a damn striper. I like a damn big one too. I ain't even seen them yet. Hell no. <laughs> I don't have a net either. There, run that. I'm going to get a damn hook in my hand probably. Why, do you want to keep them? You think he is? so damn green I'm afraid to grab him. That's a large amount. That's not a bad one. It's like two and a half pounds. Was he yeah, he was way up there. He hit it pretty damn hard. Did he? Oh, yeah. That I'm not exactly setting them on fire. There we go. As soon as I say that. No. Nah. I think they're like in the shaft. He got it sideways in his mouth, man. Yep. That almost looks like a like. Yeah. Don't. Al <laughs> Damn, <that's crass. laughs> I'm gonna lose my mind. <laughs> Please don't lose your mind. Don't he look kind of like a spot? You don't think so? I mean, he's a large mouth, but he's, he's kind of built like a spot, right? That looks a lot like one. Hell, if he had the spots on it, I'd be fooled. Definitely a large mouth. Good thing you had that thing on. <laughs> you would have got a crotch full of fish. Every one of these 
this got water on it? We'll have a fish on it. Two and a half. Yeah. I'm telling you. He's swimming off with it. So you can. S I got like three cranks. Feels pretty good. Oh, are you kidding me? Damn right. Oh, well, I got to clean my carpet anyway. I hear that. That old guy fish was right. Mm hmm. So they taste good. They're just bony. Frickin' pickerel. That's a, kind of a big one, too. huh? You should clean him too. Hell no. Like, best eating fish there is. I'll throw him in there if you want to clean him. <laughs> I'm not clean I'm not cleaning his ass. Damn pickerel. I wonder if my holes got, or if my baits got holes in it. My holes got baits in it. <laughs> That's a bait right there. <laughs> I've never heard that. That's pretty good. Oh shit. That's bad, man. That's. Yeah, like, hey, look at me. I saw your bait the whole time. Yeah. Looked pretty cool. Thought about eating it. <laughs> Put the brakes on it. I couldn't catch herpes from a $2 hoe. <laughs> That's another uh, a tip. Uh, you don't want to throw past your target. You want to throw right on top of it. And uh, the louder the better. I've I've learned that. I don't even really feel like I'm fishing on Murray right now. Like I mean, this is ass backwards for this place. <laughs> no, ah, oh, damn striper. Dude, he creamed it. Oh, here we go. He's not even up. Hey, you won't. Oh, great. Now he's really got it. Ugh. Better quit that shit. I don't have pliers either. See you later. Yeah, he creamed it. You got him? Yep. Oh my God, don't lose him. That's a big one right there. Well guys, we're back at the house. Uh, it kind of sucked. Um, I, I'm going to clean that striper now. I didn't think it was going to be a catch and cook, but it's going to be a catch and cook. Anyway, I guess I might as well just show you guys what I caught this fish on today. It's nothing crazy. Just a little Strike King 1.5, KVD 1.5. I think everybody owns these things. It's an easy bait to just go down the bank and just chunk and wind. That's probably the least fun part. This is probably the least fun part of a catch and cook. 